Lego Mario is not ending, apparently, kinda. New Lego City sets and more. This is Lego news. Remember when Lego Mario was ending? Well, that's not happening anymore, apparently, because Lego is releasing new 2024 sets in January. And of course, the thing everybody wants to know is, will we get minifigures? Recently, Brick Merge released details about the upcoming Lego sets. We have 5 sets for 2024. We have a $10 set with 107 pieces, 2 $20 sets and 1 $30 set, but the biggest set is for $45 with 500 pieces. As you may know, all three LEGO Starter Course sets, Mario, Peach and Luigi, are retiring in summer 2024, and apparently that's still happening. So, say goodbye to the Big Mario, Big Luigi and Big Peach, which leaves these new sets in a weird place. While well, some LEGO fans have noticed something off, they don't usually have price per piece like this, right? Remember the two $20 sets with 230 pieces, other previous LEGO Mario sets like the Desert Pokey had only 180 pieces and that's a pretty big gap for the same price. The $74 set with 500 pieces is similar to Luigi's Mansion entryway though. Now this causes some to go and say, hey, are we getting minifigures? But I say proceed with caution, as this happened before with the Donkey Kong sets, because they include those big figures and it makes the price per piece ratio a bit weird, which indicates something similar might happen here. However, what more could they do for these new sets? We already got Ice World, Donkey Kong, if I had to say more Yoshi maybe or even Odyssey, but those are just guess guys. However, I can claim that we have been here before. Every new wave, rumors come in and we think, oh, are we getting mini figures? Haha. <laughs> but this time it is different. All big electronic figures are retiring in the next summer. So why would LEGO release this thing just to make it outdated quickly? Either they can change the retirement date or they could make minifigure sets. However, speaking of minifigures and Nintendo, we have more Nintendo LEGO sets coming in. We have a new theme. Animal Crossing, yes, the iconic game is coming to LEGO form really soon. According to 1414 Falcon, reporting via Brick Clicker and Exabricks LEGO Go, this will be LEGO minifigure based sets. We have sets ranging from $15 to a super expensive one at $75, all coming in at March 2024. Are you excited for this announcement? And more importantly, how will your island look like? Now let's go over the best LEGO set of 2023. So the LEGO Concorde. This beauty is recreated with more than 2,000 parts. This is a magnificent set, perfect for adults, LEGO fans or aviation geeks alike. Unfortunately, it costs $200 and has no minifigures. I would say the price is fair, though it's still expensive. It is branded by Airbus and uh, at the base we have this beautiful stand, similar to other ones you can find in model aircraft. From the beautiful aerodynamic delta wings to the vertical stabilizer, this set is sure to impress. It even has retractable landing gear. Now, the livery, aka the painting they put on aircraft, is not from any airliner like Air France or British, but rather it's the pre-production one. It even has Concorde written on the stabilizer. This set even includes the powerful engines. The Concorde was a supersonic aircraft that people like you and me could fly on if you had the money. Unfortunately, things didn't go too well to her. First, the high fuel prices, and then the fact nobody really bought her. And then came the tragic end with the sad accident in Charles de Gaulle airport. By the new millennium, the Concorde was retired. Ever since LEGO fans have been demanding a Concorde set, at least me. There was even a 10,000 ideas project that was rejected. But now let's go back to the real LEGO Icons Concord. This set even includes the hilarious small windows the Concord was famous for. Let's go near the cockpit with some nice aerodynamic shapes. And yes, does not Droops. Since pilots could not see out of the plane because of angled landing, engineers came up with a really clever solution. The Concorde feature what is known as a droop snoot. Yes, a droop snoot. The snoot would droop. The snoot drooped. Overall, this set is an absolutely great set. Everything from the small details. Oh yeah, did I say it has an interior with some nice seats and a toilet? This set is great for displaying your house on a closet on the office or even on the bathroom if you are crazy enough. However, not even the best LEGO sets are perfect 
and this one is no exception. I mean the price is a bit steep and most of us can't afford it. And the fact that there was an ideas project that was rejected makes this one a bit weird. Next up, we have all LEGO City's 2024 sets leaked. The reputable Brick Merge and 1414 Falco have revealed that we're getting more space sets. Spaceship, a modular space station, again, a space base with a lunar pod, space asteroid recovery, so it's like that Bruce Willis movie and aliens. Yes, guys, we're getting aliens. Don't panic, guys. For some reason, LEGO City is doing alien stuff. LEGO did do aliens in the past, but aliens in LEGO City is something interesting. And guys, remember when I said LEGO is doing so many mechs, someday they are gonna do a LEGO City mech? Well, today is the day, because we have a LEGO City space mech. Now, prices can change, so keep that in mind before you squeeze your wallet. And for the rest of the Lego City theme, we're getting what you would expect, a race car for $10, go-kart for the same price, road roller for the same price, fire engine for the same price, fire helicopter for the same price, an ambulance for $20, a burger truck for $20, Lego is running out of ideas because we already have a Lego creator monster truck in the past. And guys, build the rescue helicopter because we're getting one for $20 and you can finally save the man that has fallen to the river in Lego City, race car train transporter for $30, fire truck with lifeboat for $30 for some reason, you might need a real lifeboat after you see these prices, and just a firefighter for $60, hopefully it's not a gigantic brick built fireman, a fire station for $80, this one will include a ladder vehicle or a fire truck in everyday language, police car and muscle car chase for $20, hopefully this car went to the gym, police truck with laboratory for $55, someone should call the police because because these prices are too steep. And guys, if you are a fan of the old LEGO City Prison Island, get ready because we're getting a new one for $100. This lineup of LEGO City makes me wanna sleep. Maybe I'll actually do that. Next up, LEGO Friends. We have Heart Lake City Department Store. LEGO Friends is getting really expensive because this set costs $120. At least if it looks like a Sears, maybe I'll buy it. LEGO Friends will also do space stuff with Mars Space Base with Rocket for $90, maybe Olivia will come back for this one. Mobile Bakery, finally something we can afford. Autumn's Cough Barn, a mini boutique electric car with charging station, a karaoke bar so that you can sing a song and embarrass yourself in front of your friends. Cat Playground Adventure for $10. Step back in time with this awesome Lego vintage fashion store for $40. This could be specifically good if we get some retro stuff. The Heart Lake City Musical Talent Show, Pop Star Music Tour Bus, Farm Animal Rescue Sanctuary for $56, Oli and Paisley's Family Home for $100, and we're getting a Lego Friends Hospital for $100, and an Animal Hospital for €30, Euros. Hot Dog Truck, and even a Horse Trailer. But the best set looks to be the Lego Heart Lake City Shopping Mall. This €120 Euro set could be the best, but the question is, Will it have a bath, bed and beyond? There's also a stargazing camp in vehicle, but who cares? For LEGO Creator, rumors say we could get an animal safari. This could be cool, and more space stuff, and a buildable camera for all your retro needs. LEGO minifigures are changing forever. First, the new Marvel series, True, features these annoying boxes. LEGO fans already started putting how much they weigh, so maybe they can bring a scale to the LEGO store and measure, so they can find out who the figure is, because you can't feel for this one, unless you want to go to jail, of course. LEGO will continue this, as Series 25 will be coming in January, and then we have a space minifigure series, thanks to Brick Clicker. In 2024, LEGO Minecraft will be celebrating its 10th anniversary. So, the highlights include a frog house for some reason and a turtle house. Are you turtle enough to go inside the turtle house? Turtle, turtle. Are you excited for these new sets? Because I sure am not. Now, if you want to see LEGO sets that are actually good and you should buy, check out this video on the screen right now.